Hello everyone, Marco Cipetta for Hot Hardware here to show you the very cool, very sleek, and very thin Dell Venue 8 7000 series tablet. Now this device has some really cool features like an Intel RealSense camera, an OLED display, and it's absolutely super thin, only 6 millimeters. So what do you say we dive in and take a bit of a closer look? Before we run through the Dell Venue 8 7000 series tablet specs, let's take a look at what comes with the device right in the box. So included with the tablet itself, you'll find a quick start guide, some warranty information, and a charger and sync cable. And that's about it. There are some accessories available though. Um, Dell has a full line of cases and a tablet cover available. And it also works with the Dell Cast accessory, which essentially lets you link the tablet to a full-size display and keyboard and mouse to use it more as a uh, productivity device like a PC. Before we take a tour of the Dell Venue 8 7000 series tablet, let's talk a bit about its specifications. The device has an 8.4 inch OLED display with a resolution of 2560 by 1600. That works out to a pixel density of 361 ppi. It's powered by an Intel Atom Z3580 quad-core processor that clocks up to 2.3 gigahertz. It has 2 gigs of DDR3 RAM, 16 gigs of internal storage, but that is expandable with a micro SD card slot. It's also got built in 802.11 AC Wi Fi and Bluetooth 4.0, and of course that Intel RealSense camera we talked about earlier. Powering the device is a 5900 milliamp hour battery that Intel claims is capable of 10 hours of active battery life. The Dell Venue 8 7000 has some really cool features. Now we've already talked about the OLED display, but we should also show you the viewing angles. As you can see, even near horizontal, you can still make out what's on the screen. It is really beautiful and crisp. Colors are great and viewing angles, as you can see, are very good. Now in terms of its dimensions, the tablet's about eight and a half inches long by 4.89 inches wide, and it's only six millimeters thin. This is currently the thinnest tablet available. Now on the front of the device, you have a two megapixel camera right up here and front facing stereo speakers behind this grill. And like the uh, Dell XPS 13 notebook, this tablet has super thin bezels. So as you can see, there's very little bezel along these three sides. If we take a tour around the Venue 8 7000's edges, we'll find basically what you'd expect to see on a device of this type. On the right side, right down here, is a micro SD expansion slot behind this panel. There is also going to be an LTE version of this tablet, and behind this panel will be the micro SD card slot and the SIM slot. If we look at the top, it is bare. There is nothing up there. On the left side, there's a power button, volume rocker, a microphone hole. There's a little mic right behind there. And on the bottom, there's a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and a micro USB sync and charge port. There's some cool stuff to see on the back of the Venue 8 7000. So first is the, the back texture itself. There's this nice gunmetal metallic texture on the back that we think looks great and it does a really good job resisting fingerprints. The device isn't perfectly clean after handling it for a while, but it does much better job than many of the other tablets we've played with. Now here's the Intel Inside logo. We told you there's an Intel processor in the device but it also has an Intel RealSense camera. So right up here is a 720p camera. Down here is another 720p camera. And over here is the eight megapixel rear shooter. Now it might be tough to see on camera here, but all three of these sensors work together to basically define a 3D space. The camera on this tablet can refocus images, and it's not doing tricks to refocus. You can actually refocus with depth information and also do depth editing of Im images. Let's show you that next. The Intel RealSense camera in the Venue 8 7000 enables some pretty cool things. Now first, let me just quickly show you the Dell Gallery application here. Dell includes a cool gallery app that allows you to sort by date, um, geolocation, or even people tagged in the photo, so that's pretty cool. But now let me show you what some of the cool things the, uh, the camera app can do here. 
Now because there is real true 3D depth information in photos, it enables some interesting things. So here, now here's a guy fishing in front of a bridge. Now if I click this edit button right here, and let me hit black and white and show you what happens. If I hit black and white, I don't know how well that comes across on the camera, but you'll notice that the background turned black and white, but not the subject. Because there's depth information in the photo, it can apply the effect only beyond a certain depth. Now this is handy for blocking out backgrounds or maybe making the subject of a photo pop, but you get the idea. There's tons of different effects there. Now one of the other things it can do is take measurements. So I'm gonna tap this button right here. And now if I touch the, say the top of the bridge and then come all the way down, it is telling me that that is 37 feet 8 inches. Now it's able to discern that because you have true triangulation and you know real 3D information in this file. So I'm going to exit out of here and show you one other thing that's really cool. I will tap this button and now I'm able to refocus different parts of the shot. So right now in the distance the bridge is out of focus. If I tap it however the bridge is in focus and now the subject is somewhat blurred. Now this isn't doing fake blurring like just making a background look blurred or making the foreground look blurred. It's changing the actual focal point of the shot. You know I could focus here or you can use this slider and have the whole shot in focus or really blur whatever is not the focal point in the image. Now this is some interesting stuff that you simply can't do when you only have 2D information saved in the photo. The Venue 8 7000 is a pretty high performing device. Now come by the site for the full review to check out all the benchmarks, but let me just show you some of the uh, touch responsiveness here. Now as you can see there's minimal lag when touching. It's not connected to my finger, but it's pretty good. Now let's take a look at some 3D stuff as well. The Dell Venue 8 7000 is based on an Intel Atom Z3580 processor with integrated Intel HD graphics based on an Imagination PowerVR G6430 graphics core. Now, as you can see, running the 3 d Mark benchmark, animations are silky smooth. It's basically pegged at 60 frames per second. I'm not sure if you can read that there. But in terms of usability and game performance and on-screen graphics, the combination of the uh, Intel HD graphics and this beautiful OLED screen produce some really nice images and animation. The Dell Venue 8 7000's multimedia chops are also pretty good. So here is the Avengers Age of Ultron trailer running on the device in full screen HD. As you can see, it is perfectly smooth streaming from YouTube right now. And with the front facing speakers, sound is pretty good as well. Let me turn it up and see if this comes across on camera. Really not bad at all considering how small and thin the device is. We hope you've enjoyed this quick look at the Dell Venue 8 7000 series tablet. For more details, plenty of pictures, benchmarks, and a deeper dive analysis, please come by Hot Hardware and check out the full review. And if you liked what you've seen here, please subscribe. Once again, this is Marco Cipetta for Hot Hardware. Thanks for stopping by.